Pope Francis kicks off his five-day visit to Korea today. President Park Geun-hye plans to meet him at the airport upon his arrival at 10.30 a.m. Korea time before an official welcoming ceremony at the presidential office. It's the first papal visit to Korea in 25 years. The Korean government has outlined a set of measures to clamp down on physical and mental mistreatment in the armed forces following a series of bullying scandals and suicides involving young soldiers serving in isolated frontline units. South Korea's foreign minister says North Korea will pay the price if it pushes ahead with a fourth nuclear test in defiance of international warnings. Plus, Israeli and Palestinian negotiators reportedly agree to extend a ceasefire in Gaza by five days. This as Israeli airstrikes targeted terror sites across Gaza overnight. We'll be back with a full newscast in one hour's time.